Hi there, this is Magnus Hitzden for the Developer Show. We're at the TensorFlow Dev Summit and next to me I have Ross. And you talked about something new in TensorFlow, the TFMA, TensorFlow Model Analysis. Can you tell me what that is? Well, it's a, it's a new component that we just uh, launched yesterday. Uh, we've been using it internally for a while. Mm -hmm. um, it allows us to uh, basically measure the performance of our models uh, in, in a sliced fashion. Um, and it's, it runs over uh, a, di you know, a, a distributed infrastructure, so it's not just a sampled mm -hmm. uh, kind of thing. And it, it lets us you know, take a large population and, and zoom in dimension by dimension. Uh, and really, really understand what the what the failure modes mm -hmm. of our models are. I think that cool. that's that's something that we're starting to do. So that sounds like a lot of boxes, a lot of uh, training episodes. Is is that something I can use or? Absolutely. I'm glad you asked that question. <laughs> um, so if you go to uh, the GitHub uh, and. Um, all you have to do is git clone the tensorflow slash model dash analysis uh, repository. There's an example there that I talked cool. about today uh, where you can run end to end from, from a data set through tensorflow transform, through training, through serving, evaluation, all locally. Hmm. So you can play with these things, you can experiment with them. And this is part of the TFX, the TensorFlow Extended Framework, correct? It is indeed. So the question is, how do developers get involved in this? Well, you just you go to uh, GitHub, uh, you go to the TensorFlow repository slash model dash analysis, you git clone the whole thing locally, you run the scripts, you follow the code lab, you modify things, you have fun, you give us feedback. Excellent. So go out there, do some serious model analysis with TFMA. I'm Magnus Hitzden for the Developer Show. We're at the TensorFlow Dev Summit here with Ross.